Ben, uh, oh, Stephen Marsh, Ice Time Hockey Southwest. Uh, ben, uh, an overtime win. Um, it was a tight game. Um, what do you think? Thoughts on the, on the game? Yeah, I mean, I think we showed a, a ton of resiliency as a group. I thought we, uh, you know, we got into penalty trouble and we had guys have to step up in roles that um, they typically aren't in. We had uh, Peter Delivatory playing forward on the penalty kill. So we had guys that were kind of out of position and then what they're used to. But I thought as a group we stayed really positive. Um, you know, we didn't get down, which, uh, you know, is a, a huge testament to the character in the room. And I think, you know, we just did everything we needed to, um, took it to overtime and then obviously got fortunate with a, a power play and then took advantage of it. So. Uh, you know that's a big win that we're really happy to get. And uh, Shen, take, take me through the uh, the overtime goal and just what that was like and, and how, how that came came to be. No, it was a good feeling. Uh, I think we needed that win uh, really bad uh, to get off and have have a few days off now and have that feeling in the group and the practice too. So it was a good feeling to to end that game on the right way. And then uh, this now you have the the um, the road coming up and. What is it going to take to continue this momentum as you guys hit on the road for the next few games? Um, you know, I think just just trying to get better every day. You know, we can't be um, we can't get content at any point and stay. Um, you know, we, we got to stay hungry. You know, we we uh, took those two games this weekend, but that doesn't really mean anything when we start on Wednesday. So I think we just got to try and get better every day. Like Elvie said, we have a, a couple days off here, so we'll get some time to just kind of regroup, get our legs back under us, and then uh, you know look forward to the next team and. And hopefully take all the points next weekend. And I apologize, I said so, but you're Lucas, sorry. So just, um, what is it going to mean for you guys? Uh, what, what, what about for you? And just, and what do you think the team has to do? To win these next games? No, we just got to stick to what we've been doing this weekend. Uh, we've been playing really good. Uh, we miss a lot of guys, but that doesn't matter. I think all the guys that's stepping in uh, is doing a really good job. So. Uh, I think we just got to be happy in the group, uh, be good at practice, be sharp, and uh, yeah, be ready for the road trip. And, and, and being at this level, you guys are familiar with this, but obviously there's always a lot of roster shuffling and lines shuffling just because of all the rosters. There was a move before the game today, earlier today, when Paul Carter was called up. So how, how, does, how do you guys manage that, uh, Lucas? Just how do you manage just always being in different lines with people and just trying to keep, keep the chemistry with no, we there's sometimes we change the lineup and that stuff, but we we know we know each other in and out, so we know what that guy can do. We know what everybody is capable of. So it doesn't matter who you play with, you always get a good line. Uh, you always go out there and do your best, and you know what you'll get from the other other guys. So so no, it doesn't matter who you play with. It's always going to be good.